Brother Earl, the oh, let me know when we live. We, we live? All right, cool. Well, first and foremost, give a fan. This is a fan tag. Monastic evening tonight. We got Brother Earl here holding it down as usual. We got this awesome energy. And you know, this in itself, <coughs> I dub it post pandemic poetry. This is where the live energy, live nation. And we got our special feature, you know, Brother Ayaba Mandingo tonight. He's in the house. So we already know it's going to be classic. We got a lot of classic poets in here just dropping it. And that, listen, it's all love in here. It's all love. Mona, with Mo Mona actually hobbled her way in. She she could she's watching the lives or whatever. So so I be, I'll even show y'all a text. I said you're gonna hobble over. <laughs> exactly. She had, couldn't resist. So you know it's a special evening. Once again, thank you, Kyrie John. Mandingo here. All, all of the social network, just type my name in. Mandingo, I'm the only one. It's only one Mandingo out there. Brother Earl, this is so old school and so throwback and so 90s, baby. Love you for this. Love you for this. Love the flavor. Yeah, haul them all the time. Peace. Hello. What brings you out tonight? Um, what brings me out tonight, um, you know, just seeing new things, photograph a lot of people as well today in this event. Um, yeah, there's a lot of, that's, what's it called, a lot of fun people here tonight, just, you know, here to take pictures, that's all. So I understand you're here in New York visiting. Can you tell me a little bit more about that? Yeah, so I came here to visit from Puerto Rico. Um, it's been like over seven years since I've been here. So a lot has changed since back then. So um, it's good to see, you know, the city in a way it's sort of similar, but also changed a lot. So I'm really glad to be back after so many years. And in photography, what's your area of expertise? Um, for photography, I'm more in depth about like nature wise, just taking pictures of the outdoors. Um, so coming out here to this event is a new skill for me for sure getting to photograph all these people out there. There's a lot of action, there's a lot of uh, emotion out there, so you gotta be on your toes when you're taking pictures, that's for sure. That's fantastic, Kevin, and out of curiosity, if someone wanted to hire you, buy any of your work, or just in general, get in contact with you, where would we find you? Yeah, of course, so um, one great way to find me would be on Instagram, uh, it's uh, Kalo Bro. Um, there's most of my work when it comes to taking photography. You'll get, you'll be able to see all my pictures from being out in nature to now uh, eventually moving to like taking pictures of people and all, all that sort of stuff. So, contacting me there if you uh, want to reach me. And last question: What advice would you give to someone who is just starting out in the photography and videography hobby? Uh, first advice I'd give them: Just pick up a camera and just start taking photos. I mean. As long as you just keep taking photos, you eventually start getting the hang of it. Practice, you know, play with your little buttons in there on the, in the camera, and uh, little by little by little, you start getting to get better and better, and little by little, you you get uh, professional photos. 
Kevin Lopez. It has been an honor interviewing you. Thank you so much for being here tonight. Uh, we all of New York and all of Harlem wishes you a very safe trip back to Puerto Rico, and we hope to see you very soon here in New York. This is Iris Hernandez and and Kevin Lopez with DJ Mario TV. Thank you. are coming soon. Are you are ready? You ready? It's DJ Mario. F U N spell. DJ Mario and video! 212 714 7188. And don't forget, Dummy Video specializes in weddings. 212 300 5665. We also do print and photography. 917 770 6161.
Hi, this is Latoya. I'm standing right in front of Billy's Black with DJ Mario. Do you have anything to say to celebrate? Uh, yes, I would like to uh, wish Adrian and her staff, Malik, all the guys who work at uh, Billy's Black to make sure. Hey, girl. Make sure all the uh, food and everything. No, I We're going to do this over that. no because I, I was just I I wanted want there. And I then. Want I wanted that. No, uh, please don't put that. My name is Naima Barti. I am from the 845, rep in Rockland County. A shout out to Big Earl for even throwing this event. Um, my Instagram is exotic and B. That is three X O T I C and dot B. Thank you, love. No problem. Thank you. And it'll be tagged to Brother Earl. No problem. Okay. Oh, Who you are and what brings you out? You have a good time tonight. Who I am? What am I doing? Your name. Your name, yeah. first and foremost. Yeah. If you're having a good time tonight, yeah. that's all. All right. Credit card, no credit, no credit card. card. No, no, no. no. Yeah. 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 Hi, my name is Dina Gregory. I live in Harlem. I came here to have a wonderful time. Brother O has been a really welcoming and it's great vibes. Three million million galaxies like this. And in all of that, and perhaps more. Only one of each of us. Don't destroy the one named Kirk. Just be honest, speak from your heart. Thank you for having me a part of this. Lisa, I want to say thank you for having me a part of this. I am glad that I was able to make it. And I can't wait to see how lovely things go. And I wish you and your husband the best. All right. <laughs> That's it. That's from the heart. I like it. Taking our time. Oh, we have been in 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 We have the cool thing. We have to be in Yeah, but if everybody's not there, we'll just walk out of the regular walk out. No, we now. Is this a sorry thing? No. So we're not going out. We're just walking out. We just walk into the Yeah, the line up. Just walk in. Miami! Lisa? Where's Eddie at? Oh, he's a, okay, he's over there. Oh. Eddie Ben ready? I know. Everybody Whatever it is. Melon Okay, 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 Ready? Okay, well, Elise, Lisa, Rector, Haynes. I'm so happy the day is here and you're finally going to be part of my crew.
Um, love you. You're the best. And there she is. All right. Hey. Just talking about you. Oh God. Talking How about you doing? me? Yeah. Good things. Hi, baby. How you doing? You ready? I'm Are ready. you ready for me? This is for real, for real. Okay. I'm glad it's real. The first for real, time was for real, for real. For real. This, this, that was a test. That was. A we was, we was we was practicing. No, I hope not. Oh, okay. oh my All God! Right. All right, so this is the day. This is the day. You look beautiful as always. <laughs> All right. Thank you. Wow. Oh my God! Shoot wow. cam. Yes, yes. Thank wow. you so much. Wow. Oh my God! I am so honored to have my family, friends, my closest of closest and my oh my beautiful my handsome nephew right here wow. all of my family here mm -hmm. that came down from Jean from New York right the, 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 the mother that grew yes, yes. yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Oh my, my rock yes my rock. she is she's my now rock. our rock <laughs> I'm so excited we're down here in um, South Beach Miami and it's beautiful down here, and we are excited, ecstatic. The weather is gorgeous, no rain. You ready for me? Couldn't ask for, for the better. Next 25 to 50 years. Year. I'm 50 years. All right. Yeah, we're gonna squeeze right. a few more years in there. All right. Yes. Okay. Okay. Thank you so much. Thank you. All right. Yo, Eddie, you Yes, one more. Where's the bouquet? Where's the bouquet? Wait, wait, wait. Brandis needs a bouquet. Oh, where is the bouquet? Oh, where is the bouquet? Where is the bouquet? Where is the We got this nice overcast. Need to come now for that sun come out. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Yeah. You heard that right? You heard that right? But I want to, that's a good look though. You ever, you, you ever see that movie Splash with Tom Hanks? Yes. That's how you look coming out the ocean. Uh, <laughs> you know, <laughs> oh, oh, mermaid, mermaid got rid of her fins. <laughs> I got you, got you coming out the mermaid, coming out, you, yo, you remember Splash, right? I got it coming out the ocean. That was a classic. Yeah, always a classic. This party is whack. Aw, uh, don't say that. Your friends are coming soon. Are you ready? It's DJ Mario. F-U-N spells.
DJ Mario and Video. Two one two seven one four seven one eight eight. And don't forget, Dami Video specializes in weddings. Two one two three zero zero five six six five. We also do print and photography. Nine one seven 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 zero six one six one. just drove an hour and a half from New Jersey doing my medical event so and I could not miss this night this night is a celebration for the scorpions number one Scorpio though is for Mario DJ Mario as you also know him so happy birthday first of all Mario I love you so much for what you do for who you are no one does it the way you do it, believe me. I mean, you could do a 12-hour gig, sometimes 14 hours gig day, um, get two hours of sleep, get back up, go to the basketball courts, play three or four games, go in, edit your video, put it up on YouTube within 30 minutes or less, and then back out doing more gigs, celebrating someone else's um, birthday or whatever that's going on. And you just meet all the means. You meet up to every level there is for being a human being who gives. And that's what you definitely do. You give, you give, and you give. So tonight, I hope you accept our love that we're giving to you tonight. And brother, our much success for to you. I am so proud of you having this open mic every Monday. And everyone been trying to say it like they say it in the South since I was raised there. It's Air Monday. Okay? So um, continue doing what you do, Brother Earl, because this is a great thing that you do. And I wish you all the blessings and the strength to continue on each and every Monday here on 125th Street, Harlem, at Red Lobsters. So to all the poets, to all the singers, and to everyone who bless his might, continue supporting this brother. Continue being on his side, lift him up, as we should lift each and every person up. We have our days, we have our issues, but in the end of each and every day, it's what's in your heart, and you have to look in that mirror every morning or night and say what did I do to help others today so with that again happy birthday Mario it's a great journey it's a wonderful life I guess I'm saying that because Christmas is almost here but it is even with the bad the good and the difference even after my drive from New Jersey in that traffic I'm saying this must be something because I am ready to lay down Oh, you want me to hold you What brings you out today? What brings you out today? Hey, Dean Memminger from New York One News here just covering uh, the renovations of this gym here in Harlem. You know, a lot of times the cops and the prosecutors around this city are making these busts of people uh, selling drugs or crack. So they've used some of that money to renovate this gym. You know, that's a good thing whenever kids around the city can have a nice gym like this, a nice floor to come out and play ball. Definitely a great thing because playing sports often keeps kids off the streets. As a newsman, I'm often covering a lot of stories where kids are doing bad things, but a lot of kids around the city do great things, and playing in leagues like this or just in an open gym is one of those stories that I like covering for New York One. <laughs> Thank you. Let's see where you're on. 
Okay, I'm just saying thank you to everyone that helped us get these courts and for the scoreboard. There you go. And who are you? I'm Emmanuel Brewster. Okay. <laughs> don't, don't forget to say your name. Oh, my name is Nadio. His whole thing right here. He, 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 his, his whole thing right here. Louis think he nice and shit. What's up? So, my name is Louis and I'm here today. It's fire, it's fire, it's fire. It's curry. You see? My name is Ron. I'm going for the top of the league. What do you think of the court? What do you think court? of the court? Court? I just knew it was good. Okay. You said Roger and Michael. Right, right, right. What do you think of the floor? What do you think of the floor? Thank, thank you for everybody who supported and helping for making this new elbow floor and the new nets and rims and scoreboard and everything. They made this court better and stuff. And my name is Jerome Felton, and these are my friends. I want to give a big shout out to my family, my mom and dad, my brothers Thomas, James, Tyrese, all of them. Hey, yo, Thomas. Yo, it's your boy, Briscoe Dimes, on the scene. You already know. How are you, man? What do you, know, what do you think of the new floor? Yo, yeah, I like the new floor, man. My name's a bit on here, though. <laughs> But ain't on here. Yeah. But I'm living a dream, you hear it? Let me have the mic. Oh, let me have the mic. Let go, let go, let go now. This is on the news? No, it's gonna be on the Why don't you let go, brother? I'm not going anywhere. I'm right here in front of you. It's gonna be on the news. like I'm running. Well, 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 mm. here we are. <laughs> Just like anything, there's always a beginning. And uh, as a beginning, there must come an end. And we'd like to say on behalf of Blue Diamond Video and uh, DJ Mario and crew, thank you so much for allowing us to be a part of the Logan family and uh, hopefully every other family, the Olivers, the Johnsons, the Timothys, the Hudsons. <laughs> Once again, if you ever should need us uh, for any church event, uh, gathering or whatever it may be, even the volunteer. Just sometimes you may not have it in the but the budget. Uh, look out for us, and we'll always come in uh, peace. And so, two one two seven one four seven one eight eight, or hit me on Facebook under uh, DJ Mario one word, and the last name is Harlem. Well, that's that with a baseball bat. Once again, thank you on behalf of Blue Diamond, DJ Mario, Miss Logan. Congratulations and many many more years of happiness. And may you love as long as you live, and as you live. May you always love. Good night. Load this equipment. The things people don't see. are great. The kids, they got their heart into it. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Shout out. Okay. 
to the best Monsignor in the world. The Martini Casado. You know it, you know it. That's it. Yeah. Say no more. Show me the money. We love our Montaigne, St. A's has it made in the shade. Anyway, I want to say happy birthday to Mario. Um, I came here. Your, your family, I, you know how, how I feel about you. you. You basically everything to me. Big brother, father, everything. You've never told me no on nothing. You've always been there for me. And, you know, my birthdays for me, for you, are kind of sad. That means you're getting old, you know? But I love you. I love you. <laughs> Mario, it hasn't been long enough, put it that way. We love you. We're always going to be there for you. We're always going to watch out for you. And hopefully next year we'll be together again, again in Clomoca. How are your nights going? If you feel proud about your work, if everything's going the way you wanted it to. Okay. You can be as well as this stuff as I'm here with the Grammy Award winning Jeff Red. It is such a pleasure to meet you tonight. I'm Mira Ice Hernandez. We're here with DJ Mario TV. I'm having a great time. I had to change my shoes. I was dead. I have to say though, I did do a lot of dancing and I had an amazing time. Good, good. I did you get to time. dance? I had a great time tonight, man. I performed tonight. We had a good time and the place is jam packed. I didn't see anything like this in a long time. So Jeff Red, I'm curious, what has been the biggest, biggest venue you've ever filled? Um, when they did South Street Seaport, there were 10,000 people down there. So that's one of the big ones. Um, Barclays, I performed at the Barclays to a sold out crowd. And next will be Wembley, you know? Wembley? Yes. That's oh my goodness, you are destined for great things. And I have to say, with that charming smile, I'm sure he's destined for even more. Uh, tell me, what were you doing at 23? At one time. I'm sorry. What were you doing at 23? At 23, what was I doing? I was trying to get in the record business and I actually got in the record business at 23 and put out my first album in 1990 and then I discovered Mary J Blige in 1989 right before I get, well I, yeah, I got my deal in 88 discovered Mary J Blige in 89 yeah. the reason I ask is because shout out to DJ Mario and video for coming out to this event rocking it out they do so amazing, he's so well. Great MC, great DJ, you gotta come. He's always giving away free cool stuff. Like he just gave me a Polaroid camera. I don't know if you guys like digital, film, all that. He's amazing. Come out for the music, come out for the vibes, and most importantly, the free stuff, cause he got it. <laughs> peace, peace, y'all.
I appreciate you for setting this space up for poets like myself and yourself. Uh, did a great job tonight. Uh, listen, y'all come follow me at at underscore Y O N T E. Um, it's a lot of amazing content to come, so don't miss it. DM me on Instagram. Thank you, brother. Yo, man, it's your boy Smooth Baby. You can find me on IG at S M O O V E B A B Double I Me, not Why Me. Baby is easy. Street Profits, be outside. Brother Earl, second and fourth Tuesdays in the Hexagon Lounge, man. Pull Anniversary coming Listen. up. 20th anniversary of my poetry CD, Revolutionary Kind of Girl. And I, I'm planning it now. It's going to be a blowout. We're going to do this. You, you yes. have to, you have to hear her. Favorite poets are gonna it, it, was, it was almost women's night, but. She, almost. Yes. Yeah. But you're good. But I, I got to see you again. You was yes. great. You know what's going to happen. You know. But anyway, Brother Earl, thank you so much for doing this. We need something yes. like this. I hope it goes on and on and on. Much blessed success to you. Yes, indeed. Yes. Thank you to Brother Earl. God Where bless. people find you? Uh, Ebony Washington on YouTube on on uh poet lytical <laughs> on everything spotify itunes whatever you listen to please check out i'm michelle lee with diamond video on dj merit First down bookings, and I got my artist, Niaja Chanel here, who's in the building. She will be performing tonight. Tell them now. We're going to be performing Good Vibes. My name is Niaja Chanel. I'm an R&B singer, but I like to do reggae, dance hall, pop, all that feel-good music. We got the hits over here, you know what I'm saying? So it's going to be a good night. It's going to be a good night. Yay said it. Niaja Chanel, we in the building. First down bookings, women empowerment. Okay, you guys can find me on social media on Instagram, Niaja underscore Chanel underscore, wait, Niaja underscore Chanel underscore, Twitter, Niaja underscore Chanel underscore, Facebook at It's Niaja Chanel, and check out my website, www.niajachanel.com. I hope y'all can follow all that uh, Niaja Chanel, because it's only they said it over here. Uh -huh, and it's N-Y-A-S-I-A -S -S underscore C-H-A-N-E-L. Just in case you were wondering, you know, I, you know, I tried to help you. <laughs> good? Yeah, that's good. Hi 
everyone, I'm Katik Sanchez. I'm an attorney. I'm one of the sponsors for this uh, great event. Um, um, Sheldon and I go way back. He's the organizer owner of Victor, uh, Victory United, I believe they're called. Um, this is great. I love basketball. I grew up playing basketball. It's one of my bi biggest loves. Um, so I'm very excited to be here. Can we find you? you can find me online. I'm on social media, Facebook, Instagram, even TikTok. I'm in Jackson Heights. You can call me at 646. Okay, hey you guys, my name is Autumn or Spicy, whatever you want to call me. Welcome to Hexagon Lounge. I'm here Tuesday, Thursday, Saturday, and Sunday, more known as TTSS. If you want to come and shout out Brother Earl on Triple, what is it, Triple Play? It's triple Play Tuesdays. Come by, I'll get you shots, whatever you need. Come by, you know it's going to be a great time, we're here. Tuesdays at Hexagon Lounge. I am your host, Brother Earl. We are at the eve of our feature, Ayaba Ibo Mandingo, are going. We just did a quick pause for the cause, little housekeeping, but the energy is vibrant. I mean, such a collection of artists, okay? Poets, uh, uh, rappers, uh, uh, folks that just, uh, drummers. I mean, just, it's just a, an eclectic group of artists just sharing for the common good and and I just feel uh, very honored man to, to to be in a position of stewardship man be in a position of folks being able to come out and, and share their art okay Ayaba is a painter okay he's a poet all right he, he, he is a true renaissance man this is this is epic so again every second and fourth Tuesday hexagon lounge 318 West Hunt 42nd Street. I am your host, Brother Earl. You can follow me at The Real Brother Earl on IG. That's The Real Brother Earl. The same way your mama taught you how to spell. All right? So you be well and make your. Happy birthday, happy birthday, happy birthday to you. And hey, you guys can check me out on all platforms, Naija Chanel. Follow me on Instagram, Naija underscore Chanel underscore, Twitter, Naija underscore Chanel underscore, Facebook at It's Naija Chanel, and check me out on my website. Hi, it's Ida Hernandez coming to you from the Hexagon Lounge right here in Harlem, 142nd. Shout out to Brother Earl for being an amazing, fantastic host. Make sure to find him on social media, on Cash App, 
No donation is, donation is too big or too small. We are here at the Harlem Lounge. Come over for happy hour or for open mic every other Tuesday because it is a blast and worth your time. Thank you. Brother, you want to mute me? Hi, ladies. Would you like to say anything to the host, Brother Earl? <laughs> I just want to give Earl a shout out for this nice uh, event, open mic. Some of the monologues are very, very deep, and I told him I'll be back, and I'm back. Maybe if I get up the courage, I might do a piece myself in the future. How about you? For you, darling, you plan on doing a piece yourself? Well, this is one of my third times back, so every time I come, it's a different event going on, so this is nice. I look forward to seeing you beautiful ladies soon, very, very soon. <laughs> Hi, darling. Would you like to say something to Brother Earl, the host? Um, hi. I don't know. Well, tell me, uh, this is your first time here at the Harlem Lounge? No, it's my probably third time. And why do you keep coming back? Uh, my boyfriend be coming here and he be performing sometimes. So, yeah. Oh, so she's the support. She's the woman behind the man. All right, all right. I see you got your count on, Queen. Wonderful. What's your name? Rosa. This is Rosa. Rosa. Here at the Harlem Lounge. You can find her and her boyfriend supporting each other here at the Harlem Lounge. Thank you. Hi, good evening. What's your name? My name is Ken Taylor. Ken Taylor, I just saw the performance you made. He basically told a story. He gave the audience options. What kind of story would you like to hear? And the audience got to hear a very amazing story. I have to say that takes a lot of courage to do what you did twice and then come on stage to share your story. Tell me, how long have you been writing stories? Um, I don't write stories. I tell stories. Tell stories. I write poetry and I write music, but this is a new part of my um, my creative life where I'm doing spontaneous stories now. Yeah. That's so beautiful. So tell me, what kind of advice would you give a 23-year-old just beginning to starting to write stories of her own? What kind of advice would you give me? Um, be truthful. Be true to yourself and have courage. Thank you so much. Can I get a hug? I love your po your story. Thank you so much. We're here at the Harlem Lounge with this beautiful, young, talented lady. Remind me your name? Rendia. Rendia performed an amazing poem that I have to say left me shook. Tell me, why did you decide to go to Guatemala? What did I do in Guatemala? Why did you decide to go? I did yoga teacher training in Guatemala, and I just wanted to have a different experience. So I said, if I'm going to do it, let me do it all the way. I'm going to do it in the mountains. That's beautiful. Tell me, did you learn something about yourself? Oh, yeah. I definitely learned that we are much stronger than we think we are. And it was interesting to be in a place that felt untouched by humans. Because it was just in the mountains, it was green, it was beautiful, it was peaceful. The folks themselves were so beautiful and lovely. And I just needed some place that was not concrete and cars and noise so yes got it so if someone wanted to go to guatemala and experience a somewhat similar experience whether to get their yoga teaching certificate or just to have a really great time what part of guatemala did you go to i went to lake atalan which has a lot of yoga retreats and nature and things to do i would recommend going when your spirit calls you i say look it up if your spirit calls you go and you'll meet people that are just like you kindred spirits i didn't speak the language but we just speak from the heart because after all like we all the same anyway right emotions physical language all of that is very very important thank you so much for performing tonight and for thank just you. coming sticking around and supporting the rest of your colleagues thank you of course you want to talk sure hi hi i don't know you what's your name yannick I'm kidding, I know her. I've known her for 12 years now. Yannick, I know that you were sharing a little bit about a poem. Artists like just manifest their, their incredible greatness and uh, just to be a caretaker of sorts uh, it is, a, is an honor that I, I am uh, certainly blessed to be, uh, to have, you know, to be a part of. Absolutely, and we love having you participate and host this entire event. In fact, just a moment ago, I was going around the room asking people what they would say to you in terms of giving you a shout out or just thanking you. And a lot of people say wonderful things about you, but I have to be curious, 
Who inspired you in the first place to do what you're doing today? Well, I think that's a, a, a complicated answer. One, I can say that as a, a young, as a teenager, I was into hip hop, so I was an MC. So I did say yes, yes, y'all. So it is kind of part of my DNA. Um, there are certainly poets that have inspired me. You know, we all read Langston Hughes. I always love the, the emotional weight of Maya Angelou. I mean, I love the, the, just the, 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 the thickness and the joy in her words. Um, how can I leave out the last poets and Gil Scott Heron? I mean, you know, there's a number of people. And, you know, if we take it to the source, my father was an incredible storyteller. So uh, all of those people have poured into me and is responsible for the man you see before you. That's so beautiful. Tell me, where can we find you on social media? Because I know a lot of people who are going to be watching this haven't met you yet, haven't had the privilege of being in your presence. Where can we find you on social media? On IG, you can uh, follow me at The Real Brother Earl. That's The Real Brother Earl, the same way your mama taught you how to spell. Okay, uh, by all means, uh, this is a movement. I do other shows beside Hexagon at every second and fourth Tuesday. So please uh, follow me and uh, stay uh, uh, updated for, for my movements. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you for having us here. So once again, this is Irai Hernandez here at the Hexagon Lounge. I'm surrounded by people who are vibrant, enjoying happy hour. There's definitely a lot to see here, not just the performers, but how folks are interacting and enjoying being out of their home, definitely relaxing after a day of work or just a day of leisure. So this is Irai Hernandez. You can find me at I-R-A-I-Z-X-O-X-O -X -O underscore Aztec Princess or just I-R-A-I-Z on Facebook. I can show up to your event as well as a team where I work with DJ Mario TV. We can show up to your events to host, to perform, or just in general to film and photograph important events happening in your life. Thank you. Um, I'm basically a cosmetologist, a hairstylist. Um, I do, I cater to black people here, um, to black women here. Um, I do all kinds of um, ext hair extensions. Um, I'm basically Khadijah Weaveologist. I weave, I put extensions, I interlock, I do natural hair styling, I dreadlock. Just about everything that has to do with the black woman hair. Where are you originally from? Originally from Africa, Gambia, and Senegal. A necklace. Mm -hmm. Beautiful necklace. What does it mean to you? Um, my necklace is about Africa and, um, and how I just love Africa inside and out. I mean, when you think about Africa, you just think about everything that is black. And black is beautiful. 
and when I'm walking the street I want people to notice Africa right away even if I don't have on African clothes or African people but automatically when you see me you are going to see a piece of Africa and that's why I love this chain so much I'm located at 1278 Clay Avenue, the corner of East 169th Street, Bronx, New York, zip code 10456. My social media is Facebook Khadija Hampton and also Instagram Khadija Weaveologist. My phone number is 718-588-1380 and my cell number is 1914-224-6093. The music in the zoo! The music in the zoo! You said the girl? The girl, the girl! Oh. The music in the zoo! Okay, alright. Hey, yeah. Happy birthday! 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 They're going to have to help you, you understand, because this is the place to be. Hey, uh -huh. anybody want to shout out for happy birthday? Uh, I don't know her name, she's the first I bought her a drink, but uh, happy, birth happy birthday to everybody. <laughs> I cannot say. Dad, everything is good, I love it here, and happy birthday to everybody, and for all the people that's not here with us. Yes, sir. Shout out. My name is Carl, aka Big Money Grip. You know what I'm saying? Here in Hexagon Lounge. Shout out to Brother Earl for inviting me out. You know what I'm saying? Good vibes. Black owned spot. You know what I'm saying? This is what it's all about. Hey, what's up there, social media? Another day above ground. Shout out to all those who have supported me over the years. Uh, I've been doing this video thing since uh, we tried to put, no, we, not try, we actually put Barack Obama into office. That's how long I've been rocking out on this video camera and uh, wheels of steel that started back in the early, early 80s. Shout out to uh, Ralph McDaniels. Yo, shout out to all those who put me on and a shout out to Mike Woods from Fox 5, Good Day New York. But today is today and yesterday is history and tomorrow's a mystery. What brings me out here at 318 West 142nd Street is the real brother Earl. Uh, this happens every second and fourth Tuesday. Uh, so many things happening here at Hexagon Lounge. It's black owned, black operated. The food is good. I've tried the food. The food is awesome. And the happy hour is definitely off the chain. You want to check out the star tenders, uh, Autumn, <laughs> uh, Nellie, and I think the other girl calls herself Yummy Yum. Or, or maybe she was just teasing me. Anywho, uh, when we go inside, we're going to find out exactly what goes down. But I want to once again say if you need me to come out to something that you have up and coming, especially if it's basketball. <laughs> yeah, this is the open 50 baller, y'all. If it's basketball related kid related please let me know how i can volunteer uh you can find me on instagram under the same name over 50 baller you can find my videos on youtube under my government name which is mario gray or you can find me on social media under the same name over 50 baller peace and blessings and the number is 646-548-5881 646-548-5881 thank you to my family out in brooklyn 789 quincy street between ralph and patchen shout out to my family in ecuador my family in south carolina Gadsden, South Carolina, and of course, my family out there in Baltimore, Maryland. Uh, well, that's that with a baseball bat. Thank you once again. And like I say in most of my videos, make sure you take care of yourself. The three things, physical, mental, and spiritually. 
mentally, physically, and spiritually. Take care of those three things in your life, and once you've taken care of yourself, then hopefully you can help someone else out. Always take care of yourself first, and then maybe you can help someone else out. Kindness goes a long way. More after this commercial break, and thank you again for watching. DJ Mario <laughs> TV. Yo, 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 y'all can hear me? Oh, I gotta stay for D Black now. You know what I mean? I'm here. I gotta stay for you. I gotta stay for D Black. But yo, shout out to Trip, what is it, Triple Play Tuesdays? Triple Play Tuesdays. My my mentor, Brother Earl, got this shit rocking right now. You know what I mean? Like, you already know how it is. Like, I came through, did my thing. I got a book out right now. It's called If Ever We Were. You know what I mean? Go cop that. My name is Hatch, just like matches with the Ace, but please don't sleep on me. I got some shit to say. And thank you for the time. Like, I appreciate the space. Like, I just want to say that. You know what I mean? That's all I have to say, bro. Like, you got to edit that after that. Like, that's all I had, bro. That's all I had, bro. That's it. That's what I'm talking about. You heard? Yeah. And we, we got some folks to still get thank back you. on here. I let D Mecca spin some treats for us, man. I love the way your, your blend game is tight, man. We can find Yo. you on social media. Oh, I got okay. some folks in the building. Okay. Huh? That uh, want to jump on and... You know, I think the sister over there went around. What's good, what's good, what's good, good fellas? Shout out to my man DJ Mario TV. But it's yours truly, D Mecca. Uh, the soul conductor. I could be found at I am D Mecca on IG at I am D Mecca on Twitch. Um, Tuesdays, Wednesdays, and Thursdays, 10 a.m. to 12 p.m. Come check me out. All right. Thank you. Peace. Okay. I think when I met him, man, I still had an afro. Like, you know, like, shout out to like, brother. You know, like, I still, it right. might have been a mini one, but it was... It was all right, all right, all right. My name is Ken Taylor. My Instagram and all of my uh, social networking is Sky Culture Muse at Sky Culture Muse. I am a songwriter, producer, poet. I'm a published poet, published writer. Also, I'll be giving a open mic on the 24th at Scion Cafe on uh, St. Nicholas Avenue. Coming up on the 24th. And it's going to be um, a different type of affair because it's going to be filmed for a TV show and also all types of different uh, performers is going to be there. So that's all I have to say right now. You check me out at Sky Culture Muse and that's that. Thank you, sir.